Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, I'm kind of toying with some different backgrounds and different areas in my house. And I think I might have found the right one just because of the natural light that comes into this room. It's like amazing. Hopefully it doesn't look too washed out. Hopefully it's not too bland. I know it's kind of eh. But um, the light is just like amazing in this room. So hopefully this works. So today I have a very fun unboxing. Jujubee re-released some of their retired Tokidoki prints and Hello Kitty prints just the other day, or I'm sorry, a week ago. And I was able to score not one, not two, not three, but four of these awesome items. These were extremely limited, extremely low quantities, and they weren't um, released from, they weren't re-releases from original items. They were what they called Kristen's Cut Up Shop, and what they did is they went to their manufacturer, asked if there were any old prints or material that was left over that they could make some new items out of. And they made two helixes, one in Donatello Sweet Shop, one in Kaiju City. They made, oh gosh, a few different mini bees. They made, remade Kaiju City mini bee, Donatella mini bee, um... Hello Sanrio Mini B, Out to Sea Mini B, and I think that was it. And then they also did a Black Ops Sporty, which is amazing because the Black Ops print is just so beautiful. So I would love to show you guys what I was actually able to score the night of the release. So let's get into it. So here we have the Donatella Helix, and I'm sorry you guys that... This is obviously a week late and you don't have the chance to score one of these beauties, but if you see one on the buy sell trade group, I would snag it because these are great. This is awesome. So this is the Donatella cut up shop uh, helix and it has the nor it comes with a seatbelt strap and the pad for the seatbelt strap and the interior is the original mint um, Donatella sweet shop interior. And the Helix, it has this great front pocket, this great mommy pocket. It just has the one mesh pocket here. And then it has a tech pocket here on the outside. And then inside, it has the mesh pockets on each side, the front and the back, or the front and the back of the bag. And then on the back, it has a nice size pocket and then another zippered tech pocket. So... This is mine, and oh my gosh, I'm in love. It's gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. So that was the one item that I scored. Another is this great Helix. This is the Kaiju, Kaiju City Kaiju City Helix. And same thing. It has the mommy pocket, the tech pocket, the interior, which is this great green, which it never came in before. This is new with the Cut Up Shop release. And... I just think it is so pretty. If you stay tuned for the end of the video, I'm going to pack this beautiful baby up for a quick day out for errands for my son, who's five months old, and myself. So stay tuned at the end of the video. I was able to score this beautiful mini bee Kaju City. It is just great. And look at this beautiful purple lining. It's different than the original. And it's also different than the Helix. The Helix is the green. This one is the purple. And it's so pretty. Look at this. It's just gorgeous. And I love the placement here. I have this cute little fireman down here. I love it. There wasn't a, There's not a whole lot of Donatella on this one. I believe she's behind the tag. I'm not detagging. Don't worry. However, I do wish that... She was on the bag a little bit more. There's some cute pandas. She is on a couple pockets and things. Um, but I just, I love, I'm loving this. And I can't wait to pack this up for my son. I will show you guys a packing video when we start using this one. It might be a little bit because I do want to use a couple of my other bags first. And then I was also able to score this gorgeous one. This is the Mini B space place tokidoki space place and again donatella is under the tag i'm not going to do tag it i want to i really really want to but i'm not doing it and it has this gorgeous hot pink hot pink and look at the puppy planet i love it 
this one doesn't again doesn't have the best placement however it has the cute little unicorn here it's got a little bit of moths here but the interior look at this this is just killer it's killer see now here are these gussets this is what they need on the brb they need some gussets that would just be amazing it would make the bag so much better and the poppy planet on the strap i just love it so so now that you guys have seen what i scored the night of the release and i am so excited and so happy that they brought those prints back for such a limited um, amount of time and hopefully they bring back some old retired prints that would just be amazing i love the fact that they did that because i am relatively new to jujube i started when i found out with my i was pregnant with my son i bought my first jujube bag i bought the duchess print bff i loved it i then discovered jujube and their amazing prints and tokidoki amazing prints and I just can't get enough. I really can't. When they said they were releasing some of the old retired prints of Tokidoki and Jujubee, I was like insanely excited. So of course I was on there right at the release time getting all of the items that I wanted and I was so happy, so happy. Still am so happy that I got what I got. Let's all cross our fingers that Jujubee brings back some of those other retired Tokidoki prints that we all love so much. So now let's get into packing up this. So all of these items are going to be going into the Kaiju City Helix. Um, I'm just going to be running a few errands with my five month old. We don't plan on stopping for lunch or snacks or anything like that. I just need to run to the post office, the bank, you know, the usual stuff. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is showing you guys how I'm going to pack this bag girl, this new beautiful baby up and show you guys how I get everything to fit. Aren't the mixture of prints just absolutely adorable? I had so many small set pieces and mediums and larges that I never use and I thought ah, this is a perfect opportunity to pull everything out and use it all together. So let's get going. Here is the Helix, the Kaiju City Helix. And I actually do have a Kaiju City Mini or I'm sorry, the Kaiju City Quick. So let's get all of this in here. So this is, inside the Quick I have baby's diapers. I have three disposables, a change, um, a wet white pouch, and a little tube of a and ointment. I do disposables on the go when we're out and about and when we're on vacation or something, and then I do cloth when we're at home. It's just easier for me. It's how I prefer to do it. So I'm going to put this one, let's take out the handle. It comes with this great seatbelt strap. And I'm just going to throw, I think I'm just going to throw everything in basically. Okay. So that one's just in there onto the side. All right. Now, um, in this beautiful Rad Hearts large set piece, I have a onesie, a pair of um, sweatpants for him, a bit or a uh, bib slash burp cloth, and then a pair of socks. And this all fits in here beautifully. I don't don't have the strap on it, so we're just gonna throw that one right on top of the quick. Then we have this is the Uniki uh, 2.0, I believe. And in here, I just have some of his toys. I have his Sophie, his Wubbanub, uh, Rattle, and a little chicken. He loves, these are his, some of his favorite toys, so I try and use these often for him, bring them along. The beautiful interior of this one is that gorgeous pink. Look at that, it's so pretty. I love that it's like teal on the outside and then pink on the inside. It's so beautiful. And I'm just going to put that one right on top of this guy. So we've got the quick, the hearts, and the um, uniki, and then some of these smaller set pieces. This is the sea punk small set piece, and this is the small set piece in sea punk. And inside here, I just have some sunscreen, Tylenol, band aids, antiseptic wipes, stuff like that. I like to keep this packed up for like a mini first aid kit, and take this whenever I leave the house. And I'm just going to put that in this front pocket here. I'll put it behind the mesh. 
And then in this small set piece, I have my uh, lifesavers or my mints, my chapstick, some hair ties, a little mirror, gum, and some lip gloss. And I'm just going to put this in the front as well. So they're side by side there. And then my uh, hand sanitizer by The Honest Company. I'll just fit right in there. Oops. This cute little Toki Pops coin purse is my wallet and my cash in here. So I'm going to... It's just small because I only have a few errands to run. Not many... I don't need a bunch of cards or anything. I know exactly what I'm getting. So I just stick that right in the front pocket there. Now, as you guys can see, it all fits very nice. Zip this bad girl up. I'll put my phone in here when we're ready to go. And the, here's the interior. There's definitely room. So I'll grab my nursing cover and I will just throw it in on top. So now we have everything for a quick trip to town to run some errands. Here is the Helix packed up as a shoulder bag. And then you can also extend it out and use it as a crossbody. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. Let me know what you would like to see in the coming months. If there's a request for, if there's a large enough request for any type of video, I would be more than happy to do it for you guys. And we'll see you later. Bye-bye.